Let's do it. Go, 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 Godfather. Part one and two. <laughs> oh man, you know what? They should make a, a game based on Time the God and the uh, movies. Which are themselves based on games and other movies, but anyway, right? They, you know, they actually made a Godfather game back then. Like, um, back when it came on. It was like a DOS 2D shooter. That's kind of hard. Everything was shooting at me from what I remember. I could never make it past the first level. I have fond memories of the Commodore 64 DOS Western game. I mean, it's not like the gameplay was good. Yeah, see, the thing is, the NES version has better graphics and audio, and obviously better controls because they had two buttons instead of one like the Commodore, and, and it was almost the same game. But the NES version had like this really horrible end game thing that they added on, like really bad. Um, so that basically made the game almost impossible to finish once you were done with the regular game. Whereas in the Commodore version, they just skipped like that whole part. Basically, once you finish the regular gameplay, you automatically went to the, uh, to the top of the final building and won the game. Oh, you mean the stairs, right? Yeah. So yeah, everything else was the same. Part. Once you were done, you were done. And it just opened oh, up your money. He, uh, he said that that's possible, but you need one of those terrible controllers. Yeah, probably. So anyway. Um, and it also gave you a password at the end. So like you can start a new game plus with your money and equipment. Which is pretty awesome. So you can just think that's like a uh, proto RPG or management sim tycoon type game. You just play through the game multiple times, earning more money and power every time. Interesting. So wait, the code will save like your racked up stats? I figured it would just save like. Uh, at the value. Uh, the password saved, well maybe it wasn't equipment, maybe it was just cash, but since, you know, you can buy all the equipment at the outset if you have enough cash, it's the same thing. And because it was on a computer rather than that, password is, passwords are easy to remember and type. They weren't like gobbledygook, they were names and such. Interesting. And there were pre-existing passwords too. That were secret that you could use to start off with a lot of cash, that sort of thing. I did yep. So anyway, you can see why that would make a much better game than the Nintendo. I figured all versions were bad until that uh, that third person one that came out. Like the computer one? The one that's on 360 PS3. Oh yeah, the latest Ghostbusters 3 game, basically. It's actually not the latest. The latest is Sanctum of Slime, which is really Let's bad. Uh, forever. <laughs> I think Atari would like to do that. Oh god, the Kratos guys are here. I don't give a fuck. Chronostone. <laughs> Uh, it appears to be on the roof first. Oh, Minion's got it. I don't know where to get it. I'm getting- I'm gonna try and get it. Too late. I missed. I'm gonna die soon. Uh, oh, me too. That's not good. Oh, well. Is that about that? Okay, you didn't know. It's really 
really dark and I can't see, but I'm close. Got it. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that like it's all the way down. Oh, it's up. I see it. I got it. Oh, nice. Chrono stone somewhere. Uh, up again. I see it on the roof. There we go. Got it. Nice job. I'm gonna die in a second. I'm dead. I see you're still in. Oh my god. That's yeah, okay. Neither one of us, whoever's closest to you. No. Oh. So close, and yet so far. And the end. Just went and grabbed the fucking gun. Man, we thought we had mastered this game, but then they go ahead and make everything harder again. Wait, well, they made it hard? Oh yeah, yeah, the, the patch. It really is harder. I noticed there was more uh, enemies. Yeah. Excavation time.